Do you want me to say anything or just show them? Yeah, go for it. Worlds for tipping. Our world is Antarctica at the top. Mm -hmm. Marbles are for losing. <laughs> this. Do you prefer this world? Pretty fancy, isn't it? Or this one. Multiple worlds. Worlds of a tipping and marbles are for losing. And whales. World's first right to play enshrined in law. Maybe play should be compulsory. Tip those worlds over faster. Okay, perfect. Okay, so these bats are against each other. Yeah. Yeah. to the top. There's the Kinsuke running through it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why the slate? Um, first bit, just because it's Wales. <laughs> and chartered and right to play. Those are roofing slates. Housing and homelessness. Mm. And just then, lastly, blank slate, as in, you can write anything on your life. <laughs> Where's the walking stick from? Some crap catalogue. <laughs> 
probably some exploited workers somewhere. Uh, I, I don't know. It was, it would have been some like disabled uh, website of aid. So it is an actual walking aid. So it would be some bog standard catalogue somewhere. Mm -hmm. And you get the really crappy ones, the really cheap ones that fold. That's not quite as cheap, but it's pretty cheap. And you can't see the handle, but you did say earlier, you know, the handle is quite crippling <laughs> and it's not very comfortable. I can't use it, but it was, it was cheap, <laughs> so I could afford it for art purposes. And, well, it's pretty, isn't it? It's got fruit on. Mm -hmm. And Lynn, you'll have to join the conversation and let her speak. <laughs> <laughs> or laugh. <laughs> You're part of it. The one thing that reminds me of you talking about the... Was it the Henry Moore Spoon? William Morris the Willie, Spoon. That's it, oh yeah. That Lindsay was present at, in the, in the patch of woodland outside Lindsay with Slumlo, literally just over a year ago, it was last May, May 2021, mm -hmm. common era, when Oh, well, it's different, thing, but okay, so Marty, who we talked about last time, who lives about, lived about 200 yards from where we're filming, and I wrote a play in her honour called Names about this amazing little old lady who blows up the system. Mm. So we took the system to this patch of woodland and blew it up. And everything else went. Lindsay, what did you nominate? What, what did you blow up? I blew up um, a picture of a uterus with an IUD coil and it had a Hello Kitty branding on it. A Hello Kitty coil? Yeah. What? They were trying to, I can't remember where what? it was now, but they were trying to market the coil to young women. What? By like all this Hello Kitty branding and pink shit. I mean, I'm really, really obviously into this and also obviously <laughs> completely repulsed at the same time. Yeah. Shit. So I, I just guess that's like, why you look, well, I, I guess that's like why you put it up. of that and those things and I blew that up. Yeah, we good blew choice. up high heels. On behalf of the most revolting pair I could find, it was cheap. Mm. That's on behalf of Selma, and a whole bunch of other stuff went. Uh, DWP brand books. Yeah. Daily Mail, it resisted a bit. It went, Dear Sam, that's a diagnostic and statistic manual of psychiatry. Blew three of those up. Cool. So on the wall behind us, over there, not in shot, is Aid Edmondson, who danced Swan Lake and he was asked who had hit in the face of the frying pan he said Maggie twice just to make sure we blew up DSM three times to make really sure yeah. and we also took uh, a William Morris patterned spoon rest mm -hmm. because I thought that's the ultimate system yeah with a whole performance around it because came out of one section in, into Homes Hostel and discovered that in our absence, artists had designed spoon rests. Yeah. A lump of plastic that you rest your spoon on. And I just thought this is kind of the perfect image for everything. I bet psychiatry and Tony Blair collect spoon rests. Yeah. So we tried to blow up a spoon rest, an art, an art spoon rest. It was the only thing that wasn't even wounded. Everything else went, even the Daily Mail, so, you know, once the world that you're looking at right now on the top of the walking stick, you know, everything on it has died out, there'll be a name of artist design spoon rests left and nothing else makes perfect non sense. Yeah, it's pretty boring. Pretty just topic, isn't it? <laughs> What would you blow up? If I said the system, top of your head, what's the thing that represents the system? It doesn't matter, just the system to you. That thing, that symbol, I'd like that gone. It's probably got something to do with like the suburbs. 
um, that kind of like anodyne feeling of just like a Sunday night in the suburbs. Sunday nights in the suburbs, gone. Yeah, gone. Can I try and knock the world off from a distance without touching it? I don't know, can you? Yeah. I'd like to try. <laughs> and you're going for your, your curling skills with the broom over there, so you're going to sort of broom the floor in your area. Are you going to stomp? Are you dancing? Are you... <laughs> I stomp, but I feel like it's a little bit. Stomp? <laughs> No. <laughs> Do you want to throw some snowballs or systems? <laughs> um, How about this? Did stage a snowball flight in the Wyoming Youth Fenning Institute way down south uh, with paper? Struzler's education versus the learners, the use of the word learners then. Struzler's education versus the learners then. Everyone had a great deal of fun. Oh, oh. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank you.